Singapore has launched a new facility that can breed millions of mosquitoes every week to help the country tackle diseases like dengue using a bacterium called Wolbachia. And this comes as the number of dengue cases here hit its highest since 2014. This mosquito production facility uses technology like an automated sex sorter to filter out female pupae. It's able to churn out 5 million male Aedes mosquitoes carrying Wolbachia each week, or 10 times compared to the old facility. When these infected mosquitoes mate with female mosquitoes, their eggs will not hatch. The new facility in Ang Mo Kio will allow Singapore to scale up a project that tests its effectiveness in controlling the mosquito population to fight diseases like dengue. In Project Wabakia, there are two main phases. One is in the production and one is the release. So in both phases, it can get very laborious because especially when, it, when you want to scale them up and um, to generate hundreds of thousands a week. What we have done is actually automate the processes. Mosquitoes are currently being released at expanded study sites in Tampanese West and Nisun East to study if the use of Wolbachia technology can be sustained over larger areas. Project Wolbachia started in 2012 and is currently in its fourth phase. But Senior Minister of State Amy Kaur warned that any progress could be hampered by global warming and climate change. Even as uh, Project Wabakia Singapore continues to show good results in keeping our urban Aedes aegypti mosquito population low, uh, it is not a silver bullet. The warmer weather will facilitate the faster multiplication of um, Aedes aegypti mosquitoes as well as the dengue virus. More than 14,000 dengue cases have been reported this year, a more than five-fold increase compared to the same period last year. Experts we spoke with don't expect the pilot project to be able to solve the problem immediately. The Wilbachia is, is still in, a, in its pilot phase, right? Um, so NEA is releasing Wilbachia uh, infected males uh, to try and mate with females and suppress the uh, population further uh, in limited sites and with limited numbers. And so it's, it's some ways to go before you, I think you'll see the effect. The current phase of Project Wolbachia will be expanded early next year.